Lynx is a typical Fotaiga predator. They are medium-sized cats with small tufts of hair jutting from the tips of their ears. Fur color is gray and reddish, with spots and stripes, which help them to walk unnoticed, especially in sun rays when they stalk their prey. The fur on their chests and stomachs is white or cream in color. In Russia, lynx can be met in thick coniferous forests up to Kamchatka and Sakhalin. It can also be found in Caucasus, Middle Asia, Spain, North America and Canada. They are well adapted to cold winters, with their thick fur coats to protect them from cold. Their feet also have hair, and they spread their large paws out to use as snowshoes on fluffy snow. Lynx is an impressive skilled hunter. These cats can easily catch birds in mid-air, as well as voles, grouse, hares, mice, squirrels, and large mammals, for example deer, when it is young or sick. Before giving birth, the mother lynx creates a den and fills it with soft leaves. Usually it gives birth to between one and four kittens, who are born with their eyes and ears closed and weigh 200 or 300 grams. They usually remain with their mother until they are one year old. After that they become independent hunters. Male lynx doesn't participate in any care of kittens. Lynx and human interaction is usually a negative one. These cats have been hunted for their fur and they are also threatened by urbanization. The fur of lynx is beautiful and valuable. Its meat is similar to veal, tender and delicious. Nowadays it is not used in cuisine, but in ancient Russia it was considered a delicacy and was given at great princesses' feasts. In North America they are frequently hunted for sport. Some species are enlisted as endangered, for example the Iberian lynx or the Spanish lynx is one of the most endangered cats in the world. Lynx population rise and fall with the population cycles of hares. When hares are abundant, more lynx survive and reproduce. When hare population falls, which happens once in 10 years, many lynx die of starvation. There is a center for lynx rehabilitation in Russia, which helps lynx to return to the wild nature. It helps to save weak lynx species who suffered from men, as well as lynx kittens which remained without a mother and wouldn't survive in the forest. Lynx pets, whose hosts have given up them, also need complex rehabilitation before going to the wild. In 2019, two mature species, male and female lynx, Bransk and Dasha were given to the center. They were domestic pets, but their hosts refused of them. Their character was different. Dasha, the female lynx, when released to the wild, ran away and avoided contacts with humans. Bransk, the male lynx, continued to behave as a domestic cat. He contacted people, preferred meals and water from the dish, and refused to drink water from natural water reservoirs. In 2020, two kittens were born in the center. All lynxes are carefully studied. They are taught hunting skills, and when they are ready to hunt independently and begin to avoid human contacts, they are released into the wild. Dasha and Bransk went into the wildlife sanctuary Pazarim in Republic of Hakasia.